there, I'm Lorraine Singh. And I'm Langston Belton. And this is an Earth's Mightiest Show b, -B bonus That's right, today we are chatting up with Marvel fan turned professional basketball player, Terrence Ross. Plus, we're gonna play a game of physical prowess. Watch to see if Langston airballs or if it's a slam dunk. All right, I'm hanging out with professional basketball player Terrence Ross. Terrence, welcome to EMS headquarters. Thank you, thank you for having me. Uh, so everyone knows that you are, of course, a professional basketball player, but you're also a huge Marvel fan. For sure. So give us the rundown. What is your Marvel fandom of choice? I'm really, like, I think my favorite in MCU or just Marvel right now is, is Thanos. Mm -hmm. Like, he's just, I think he was already, like, you know, a big deal before, you know, the movies and everything, mm -hmm. but... I think after the movies kind of brought him to life, like you kind of, everybody, I was just kind of obsessed yeah. with him after that. So, uh, did what did yeah. he live up to your expectations? Oh man, he yeah. I mean, it's it's unreal. Like I watched the movie so many times, it's just like every time you see him, it's just like it's almost not enough. So it's yeah. just like, <laughs> I mean, it's just like I can't wait till his next one comes out. You just skip forward scene by scene, oh, just all the Thanos it, parts. You don't even have to skip. It starts with Thanos <laughs> and it ends with Thanos. So I'm just like, this is the perfect movie. As a fellow Thanos fan, I gotta mm -hmm. ask you, what would you do if you had the Infinity Gauntlet? Like, what's the first thing you do? <laughs> Well, I'm I'm definitely probably wouldn't be as crazy as Thanos or like psycho, but <laughs> Thank you. nonetheless, if you know he's out there saying uh, we need balance, I just probably balance it out with you would more. Do, you would do with, no, I'll do the <laughs> opposite. <laughs> I wouldn't eliminate half the people. I just you know probably double the resources. I was gonna say, would you add more people? I'll add more resources. Yeah, that's for sure. Good. Yeah, that's good. Like you know, uh, I also heard through the grapevine that you're a big fan of Wolverine. Yeah. Yes. Uh, yeah. So, uh, what was your uh, connection to Wolverine? He was always just kind of like the. The guy that was just a tough guy, I was, you know, bossing people around, doing his own thing. So, you know, kind of reading the comics, kind of learning up on him, it was just like, he's probably legit one of the greatest, like, Marvel characters of all time. Like, he survives everything. He's fought in countless battles. So it's just like, I was like, how could you go against him? So what was your earliest Marvel memory? Like, when did you discover Marvel comics? I, I didn't really read the comics growing up. Mm -hmm. And when I saw the movies, I kind of like, because when you read the comics, they're, they're pictures, so like they're just like freeze frame and them yeah. about to get like busy or whatever. And then you know you see the movies and it's like okay, now you kind of get a different aspect of you know how incredibly talented these these characters are. Like, yeah. So I think that's kind of what you know brought out to me on top of this being an action movie and it's just all these characters and it's just so much origin story and backstories to everybody that once the MCU kind of got you know really big, mm -hmm. yeah, I just like kind of dove in like head first. Is there a Marvel Cinematic Universe character that you'd want to take into a game with you? Because I mean they they are all talented, they all have various powers. Doctor Strange. Doctor Strange? <laughs> Why Doctor, Doctor Strange? Strange? I was like, just let me make 23 tonight, put a spell on me, make it happen. Like, he that's the be... guy. He, he can do anything, man. He's, he's, he's unlike, you know, the other guys who just all brute strength. And, mm -hmm. you know, he, he, he can literally do everything. So, now, he, so could we be coach, maybe? Oh, for Coach sure. Strange? Oh, my gosh, yeah. I can see that. I would love that. I'll endorse that for sure. No, well, listen, uh, thank you so much yeah. for talking to us today. Uh, I hope that Dr. Strange will accept the application. I think <laughs> no, he'd be sure. great. Another career, uh, another career choice. But thank oh, you so much for talking it. to us. Thank I don't you. want you to leave just yet, because yeah. speaking of games, I want you to play a game with us. Could you do that? Oh, boy, for sure. Yeah, let's do it. All right, we are back with Terrence Ross and a very special guest, Lorraine. Hey, I'm back. I, I snuck in. I crawled in behind the couch. Nobody noticed me. Um, so we're going to play a game. Uh, this game is called Webbed Warriors. Like Spider-Man, you are going to try to save these paper people from a burning building. They're made of paper, so you really got to get them out of there. You have your sticky hand, which is your web shooter. On your mark, get set. Save people! Okay, here we go. Oh, oh whoa. Feeling it already? Money. I'm like, oh. LinkedIn can't even get your person, but. Oh, I can't even hit. I'm very good at protecting the, the ah, outside of the building. Give me one. It's not an Oh, here we go. There we go. One to one. One to one. Scoreboard. One to one. Scoreboard. Scoreboard. Oh, okay, here we go. Goodness. Oh, oh yes. I like okay, the underhand go. technique. Yep. Very good. Oh, come on. It's the, it's the accuracy. Oh, three save people. One more. We're going. Oh, that was a two. Okay, here we go. What? Here we go. Ah, oh, figure we're tied up. We're tied up again. Ah, ah, I got the people like on the ambulance. Yeah, <laughs> the like, people near the ground. Uh, really difficult. Oh, this is not good. We got we got one more. I, I cannot one control one this thing. Okay, one more. Oh, you're uh, so close. Uh, you got him. Okay, okay, okay. We're tired. We're tired. <laughs> yes. Uh, oh, you got him. He's fine. He's I mean, fine. That's fine. That counts. There's a net down there. Don't worry. Uh, let me save you. <laughs> <laughs> Who would resist? Uh, there we go. Uh, very good. Very good. Go. Okay, uh, you guys. It's a tight game. Oh no, it's not. Whoever, yeah. whoever gets him first, I, it's, I think, wait, wait, five, no. four. He has three, there's one on the floor. Two, and one. Ah, ah that's it. You're out of time, Langston. You've been shamed once uh, again. Ah, game of was not easy. And there's one on the, there's one that was on the floor over there. There's another yeah, he person went, that yeah, he got went away. Hudson River. Oh, uh, well, <laughs> you guys saved a lot of people, but clearly Terrence saved more people. So you are the winner. You're the victor. Yes. 
Uh, don't worry, you get to take the riches of war, the spoils of war back with you uh, as you continue to dominate the court. Um, <laughs> thank you so much for joining us. Thank you guys. Hey, you know what? It's it's not if you win or lose, it's how you play the game. That's wrong, and probably uh, don't, that's not good. It's hey, about what, winning and losing. Doom would listen, say it's about winning and losing. If you're going to lose to someone, at least it was a professional athlete and not Dove Cameron again. That's true. Hey, don't bring that up, all right? All right, listen, that, that's not fair. Thanos wouldn't like it. <laughs> all right, one of these days. True. Maybe. Well, if you want to see more fun interviews and lots of other great stuff, be sure to watch our full episodes of Earth's Mightiest Show. And you guys, make sure to pick up Marvel Studios' Avengers Infinity War, available on digital, Blu-ray, and 4K Ultra HD. I'm Lorraine. And I'm Langston. And this is Marvel. Your universe.